Welcome to a video from thedigitallives.com. We have a new Windows 10 Redstone 5 build to look at. This is 17643 for Windows Insiders on the skip ahead build. And once more, there's more work in sets being done on this. And here we have sets now applying to Word. So I've got a Word document open there. I can open a new tab. I could pick a web page to go to. I could open a new tab. I could have another instance of Word or I could pick up uh, Excel, let's try that. Interesting, it didn't pick up Excel in a new tab there. It could be because there's pending updates to do for Excel. You do need to be on the Windows Insider or the Office Insider track in Word for this to work. But as you can see here, I can open a set. I can have Word, Excel, I could have uh, Edge, I could open a notepad. So if you're working on uh, a project where you've got some different sets of data you want to work on powerpoint spreadsheet you know powerpoint spreadsheets you could all open them in sets and you could have one set for one project so i could have a set for say a blog post about this new build and i could have another set completely with um you see here i've got task manager but i could have another set here completely and i could have another copy of word there and um so I could have a set there and work on a different project. So you can kind of set the, these sets are for like group projects. You can link them together like that. And so you can have Office, all the Office applications are included in it. And uh, I think that's great. Microsoft say that in this build, uh, this, most of the uh, non-customized title bar Win32 apps do it. Like you see, I've got Taskbar, uh, Task Manager, and you've seen Notepad uh, I've got there. Um, apart from some that use customized um, title bars like paint doesn't work yet um, uh, but they're working on those and um, something else they've done you can now drag tabs within sets and drop it in another set let's see if I can be a bit ambitious if I move that to there let's try and move this tab to there no it didn't quite work I think it should do though it's supposed to, <laughs> but, uh, oh no, sorry, I'm just reading the note. So, another thing they've done is you can drag and drop uh, tabs around. You can't drop between them like that yet. Um, oh, there you go, it worked. And the notes, it said it hasn't been enabled, um, but uh, yeah, it's working on there. So you can drag and drop, drop tabs there. So you've now you can see you've got multiple Office um, tabs, so I can open another tab with Office and so on. So. Um, at last, we've got tab browsing, uh, tab sets with um, Microsoft Office. Oh, there you go. That's working quite nicely. So a bit of flickering there you've seen, but um, that's because it's in development. So we've got this uh, tab uh, set experience with uh, Microsoft Office has come now as well. Just a couple of other things to finish off uh, to show you on this build. If you go through to sets, uh, sorry, if we go through to settings, uh, if you look at uh, roaming data usage, if you've got a, a SIM uh, data in there, so if I go to data, um, there will be sort of, um, there's a setting for uh, roaming, let's have a look. Actually, it won't show you because I'm not roaming, am I, of course. I'm, uh, not, I'm not using a roaming data, but if you did, it would show you up there. There's some other things with magnify have been improved. Um, they fixed some issues with reveals, some screen flicker after remote rotating the device, and they fixed some spell checking issues. There is a lot of known issues with this build. Um, the ones that carried over from the last few builds, like um, the links in settings don't always work, resuming some sleep might show the Windows screen before it, it locks, and the moves in TV issue. There's also other issues like um, tiling windows may not work on the active tabs, some office issues. As you can imagine, this is the first time that Office has been integrated with set. So have a look up for those on the digitallifestyle.com for more details. So those are the main changes I wanted to show really just uh, here the um, using Word here in sets. Uh, you can find out more on the digitallifestyle.com, our YouTube channel, and at iStix on Twitter. This is Redstone 5 17643.